When I first heard about GT6, I thought, you know, what a great opportunity. Normally on a production car or even on a show car, you have a lot of restrictions. So for the first time, we didn't have, you know, the typical boundaries. We had a mix between a very far away show car design, free and pure emotion. And still, uh, it should be a car that reacts realistically in the game. Time frame was very short, so you know we had to really speed it up. All of the designers started sketching um, some proposals. The great opportunity that computer games give you is like doing stuff you ever dreamed of. While sketching, you have to excite yourself with every line, with every every design you do. You have to excite all the others and uh, to get chosen by, by them because they think it's the most promising one. The most stunning aspect of this car is the proportion. It is so low, so wide and so fast looking uh, that it's in incredible. We have a really small uh, cabin, we have these attached really big um, spheric wheels which uh, have a smooth blend into all the other big geometric volumes. So after the 3D data was generated, uh, we looked at it and we re reviewed it and we got to a stage where we liked the car. That's when the real work begins. start out with an armature. It's a steel frame basically, it's a box frame uh, which we welded together and then we put foam underneath because the whole car doesn't need to be clay. I think one of the biggest things you need is just a, uh, a personal desire. You have to have an interest and in, you want to see these cars and if it's not something that you're passionate about, uh, it's going to be really difficult to to do the kind of level of detail and finesse that you need. We started working on the surfaces, we refined the car, we looked at the proportions from far away. When you play the game, you will have certain main perspectives that the pilot will, will see the car. So the rear perspective, for example, got very important. When I saw that car, um, the GT6, in, in full scale with the dyno gone and all the shot lines, I got goosebumps all over my body. Teamwork is essential. We all have to work in a team. We have to inspire each other. It takes so much work to get there. And the team, they work day and night, into the night, skipping meals, missing you know, things with the family. They really put in a lot of work to get the car to what we see. The exterior design promises something to the customer or to the players in this case. So the sound design is really important as well. There's this great fascination about this game. And we started playing during work. We really loved it. So we really had to play. We really had to get into it. This car will be in a competition um, to be selected by the drivers. As you know, in this game, you can drive several cars from different brands. So it was from the beginning also our task to create something that's far ahead of all the others. The design is shaping the brand and the product is the biggest brand ambassador. Car design is passion. I think that passion is what drives car design. Without passion, it would be empty. The Mercedes-Benz AMG Vision Gran Turismo very much embodies our design philosophy of sensual purity. It is a combination of something which is very emotional on one hand and very pure on the other hand. With our project, we're already showing what could be on the street tomorrow. <laughs>